Hi YouTube! I got my January Tokyo treat already. It's early and I'm super excited and my kitty is super sleepy. Look at oh look at the cute little yarn. Oh he's just so cute. And that's actually one of his Christmas gifts. He got a stand and I got other things and I might make a video of what I got. I don't know. I probably won't. Sorry about the delay. I actually um got in uh I already got in a car accident <laughs> during December. I don't know if I posted that in a video or anything, but I'm fine now. It's just I'm gonna take off my glasses. Just got in a little bender bender. Actually I was sideswiped, so I was a passenger, so kind of scary. I already opened the box, but all I did was open the box, and if you can look, it's all packed nicely. This is actually really pretty, and I got an email about it being a New Year's box, and it was supposed to be like a special thing in here, or a calendar or something. Oh, no, no, a bonus snack? Ooh, bonus snack. Like how adults give New Year money to kids in Japan, this month we put in an extra treat in your box. We hope you enjoy the bonus snack. And that's that's actually really cool. So that's the bonus snack up there. The drink is rice taste soda. That's weird. And the special item this time is a New Year's facial art mask. So I'm actually getting ready to go to bed because it's 3 in the morning here, but I'm just not tired. It was a really long winter break this year. Um, year. This is super. Um, soy sauce flavored. Oh, that was chocolate, but then it didn't feel like chocolate because the last one kind of felt like chocolate. And, okay, so it got here, like, January 2nd or whatever, and it's been sitting here in my room for, like, so long. And I so wanted to eat it, but I didn't want to eat it. But I ugh. haven't even ate some of the stuff that I have from the other box, like my um, caramel corn stuff. It smells super soy saucy. Anyway, my caramel corn stuff, I haven't even opened that. It's a cute little shape. So. I think it's hollow in the center. These are really good. No, can't stand the glasses. Okay, so I had like a headache earlier today, so these are really good. Oh, they're different shapes. This is like a shark. I would recommend buying these like they're so good like the soy sauce is like the only salt on it so it's really good Caesar's very jealous and this one is something oh my gosh I got a card on the back what is this I can't pronounce it but it's like shamami Salted chips with a baseball card on the back. I don't even know. Man, oh my gosh. Bunny scissors. I just don't want to cut the card. I don't collect baseball cards, but it's a cute card. So there's that, the front, with all his stats and on the back it's super shiny I'm gonna put him back in the bag I can't read his name I'm sorry so if anyone knows who this is like if they watch Japanese baseball or can read it I'll try to hold it more steady can read it there we go 
I'd really like you to comment below. Talking about that, like my last video got like a bunch of views, probably because it was early for them, but I was like 300 views and that made me so happy. And then I realized I had two subscribers and I'm like, why? I think they're just chips, like Lay's potato chips. Yeah. Just chips. Oh, I found the bonus. Is this a DIY too? Or is it just putting candy together? Oh, and I never mention it, but in in the thing itself, it has like different interesting things about that box or about like the theme of that box. Like this one has the Japanese a Japanese song. And I actually really like singing, so I might learn it and make a video of it. And the lyrics go, How many more sleeps to New Year? During New Year's holiday, let's fly a kite and let's play with a spinning top. Come, come quickly, New Year's Day. That's cute. But I don't know what this is, so I really want to open it. Because it doesn't tell you on any of the stuff. It just says it's the bonus snack. So I hope it's not a DIY. And I hope I can just like dump it into my hand. Oh, yes. <gasps> Yay. I, okay. So I saw something similar to this. And it was super cool. And the uh, people I saw actually really liked it. But people like sushi. That's what actually this is. I've actually never had sushi. I went to a sushi place once when I was little, but I was too young to enjoy su sushi, so I got, like, crawdads and things like that. Okay, so you take one of these, which is rice. It has, like, a little imprint of rice on it. There you go. And then you take whatever you want on top. There is rice plus fish or rice plus egg, I think. Yeah, I'm going to go with it. And then, I think this is pineapple. Could be. And then you have like a little rice and egg. That tastes weird. Wait, no, it's it tastes good. But the texture is a little off. So is the taste, but it tastes good. I guess. I don't know if I would buy this one. That one's kind of cute. Oh. I bet that was strawberry. I love strawberry. Well, that was just the bonus snack. I didn't really have anything else. And this is actually a face mask. I think I have a dragon? Yeah. He's up there. Oh, okay. It's that. Um, it's literally a face mask. I might do a video of me putting it on. Um, treat yourself to post-holiday TLC with one of three fun and festive face masks that, inclu that are included in your box. Get the rooster mask. And count yourself lucky because 2017 is the year of the rooster. What am I? Oh my gosh, I don't know. But I was born in um, 1998. If that helps. So if you know what I am, please comment down below. Um... I don't know where to put things. Oh, this just looks creepy. 
Oh, it's a one piece chocolate wafer. I might get a lot of hate for this, but I don't really like one piece. Oh, it's just a chocolate wafer, like, um... <gasps> I like getting little surprises and things, even if I don't like it. I got this little guy. <laughs> Caesar's getting angry because I'm keeping him up. So it's not a chocolate wafer. It's a wafer with a layer of chocolate between, like, two sides. I'm gonna put this guy back in. That one's okay. This is, like, a peanut bar? This is Black Thunder. <laughs> Black Thunder. This is... I don't know what flavor is Kianko. And it says roasted soy flour. Mm. Oh. It's a chocolate cookie and rice puff in it. So it's like a crisp bar. And it tastes like soy. Okay. I thought there was a peanut in it, but there wasn't. It's actually pretty good. I like that one. And then it tastes kind of like peanut butter. Oh. <laughs> Pikachu! Pika! Pika Pee! Actually, there's a couple Pikachus in here. Pika Pee! Pika! Oh my gosh, it looks like Caesar. Pika! Pika Pee! Anyway. Um, I think these are candy cigarettes. Yeah, these are candy cigarettes. This one, I don't know what flavor they are. Oh, that's, okay. So on the back, let's see if I can't get this thing. There's a little um, maze game where you're supposed to go from the first evolution to the second and then to the third. But you're supposed to go in and then through the evolutions and then come out another end. So that's actually pretty cool and I might draw on it and do that. So it comes with two sticks in it. I didn't expect it to be so hard. I think this is soda flavored. Or Ramoon. It says it's soda. Okay, so this one, these are, they're all soda flavored. So this one's just Ramoon and the other one's orange. So I'm going to finish this one and then combine the two. Okay. Let's see if you can hear it. It's super snappy. But it's like, um, I don't know what to compare it to. It's kind of fizzy. I don't like the orange. Mm-mm. 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 So, oh, wow. Like, at first, you get this orange flavor, and it's like, ooh, orange. It's kind of orangey. But then you get this flavor. I have no idea what it is. 
Mm-mm. Mm-mm. It's stuck in my teeth now. Mm -mm. So this one's grape gummies. That was so bad. I like gummies. I didn't like the gummies I just made, and I'm uploading that video right now. But it's a fun. Oh, it's very really hard. They're... Okay. Oh. I thought they all made the shape of him. Like, if I pour them out, they'd be shaped like him. Oh my gosh. Each of the little heads have a different... Okay, so here's a tail, and then his other foot, but each face has a different expression. Probably not going to show you all of them, or maybe I will. kind of feel like it. This one's angry, but then this one's sad. A little sex is going to get eaten. I'm going to eat the other sad one. They're pretty good. They have like the texture of Haribo gummy bears, which was the first gummy. So, kind of has old school texture. This feels like ooh, cheese. Fizzy, soft candy, orange and lemon flavor. I don't like orange. Apparently. Oh, it's mixed together. I thought it was going to be, like, centered. Mmm. The center is the fizzy part. Just, just like taffy. With a little bit of fizz. More gummies? Oh, it's resealable. Mm. <laughs> so, what I see on here, just judging by the package, there's tadpoles, eggs, frogs, and like you can grow them in here or something. Frog family comes in three different shapes and two different flavors. Um, the frog egg shaped gummy and the tadpole shaped gummy come in grape flavor and the frog shaped gummy is green apple flavor. Which do you like best? Well, let's see. They smell... I've said this before, but it smells like Martini and Rossi Asti Slumanti. And if you guys haven't looked it up by now, poo poo on you. Oh, they come in different shapes when they're bigger. Okay. <laughs> okay, so... On the back, there's a few shapes. It's like the tadpole that has legs, and then like there's the tadpole that doesn't have legs, and then the egg. But then there is... The next shape is like a small frog, which I'm going to eat first. Then, like, a happy frog, and then king frog. <laughs> I like the green apple. It's really nice. The grape has a different texture. Maybe it was just that one. Nope, the grape has a different texture. I don't like it. Green apple's really good. This box is like stuffed to the brim. The other ones aren't as busy as this one, I don't think. Maybe that's just me. I haven't opened one in a while. Mm. 
when you don't know what this is. Okay. Um, I have no idea what this is. It actually does not have it on here, I don't think. I think this is a Sour Plum Fortune Candy. That's what I'm going to call it. Sour Plum Fortune Candy. Um, this is like candy in Russian roulette. Each bag contains normal sour plum and a super sour plum candies. Get one that's not too sour. Consider yourself lucky. I actually like sour, but I've never had this before, so I don't have anything to compare it to on the sourness. Okay, so they're all just like pink little balls. And one's actually a little darker than the rest, and that kind of frightens me. There's six, so. Um, this one. Oh, they're hard. They don't just, like, bite into it. I think this one's just normal. It's pretty good. Mm. <laughs> Choco Panda. Shoot. Sorry, my cats are fighting. But it's just a little wafer filled with chocolate. And I've actually had this before. And this is a regular sour one. It's actually not very sour. It's really good. Hey. Anyway. Sorry, my cats are fighting. Oh, so cute. So tiny. And so cute. Such a cute little face. I love cute things. Maybe it's a girl in me. Okay, so I was expecting the um, wafer to melt away. The panda melts away too, and it was really good. Okay. Here's the DIY. And it looks like I make frosting and then dip my spoon in it and then pick up candy. That's what it looks like to me. I think I've seen this one. This has been around for 30 years. This one is grape and strawberry flavor. Okay, grape and strawberry. Um, it has two different toppings, toppings for textures. The pretzels. Okay, so last time I got pretzels too, and I think I showed it in my DIY kit video that I'm actually uploading right now. But they were pizza flavor. This one's just butter. So if I eat them together, it would be like pizza and breadsticks. I love that it kind of it just like shows you how you're supposed to open it. Like, here's a little tear here. Sorry, I have hiccups. It doesn't smell like butter. I guess it does. I've never really sniffed butter. <laughs> My cat's pushing around his water dish. They're actually kind of square. The other ones were round. These have a weird taste to them. Like, they're kind of sweet. And it's not just the candy in my mouth, but the, these themselves are kind of sweet. I actually really like these. I was expecting them to taste like buttered popcorn or something. And they taste kind of like that. But those are really good. Ooh, coffee? This one actually has English on it. Enjoy the suburb. Superb, sorry, 
Enjoy the superb taste of chocolate and biscuit make the, made with the finest ingredients. See, I thought that was um, coffee for a second. I was like, oh, it's going to taste like coffee. Here we go. So it has the wafer on the back, or biscuit, sorry, and then the chocolate. And this one has a little ship on it. I think they all have little ships on them. But yeah. I think it is coffee. No, it's red bean. That's what red bean tastes like. Really good. I can see why people like it. And it goes back in. I have a bunch of stuff in my lap now. And the last snack before the drink. They're like little burgers. Condensed milk, choco, and pen. There's no English, so. It's a traditional Japanese, popular traditional Japanese pastry, usually filled with um, sweet red bean paste filling. Instead of red bean this time, the, um, it's filled with um, sweet and condensed milk. So it's just a little bun. Cute little bun. A little burger bun. It's just bread. Bread. Filled with milk. This is actually a really good snack. I like it. That one's good. And my drink. Which looks weird. What was it again? Oh my gosh. This is Calpis. It's a lactic acid, lactic acid yogurt drink that is loved by all generations in Japan. Limited edition. This one's a limited edition um, rice taste soda, which boasts being thicker and creamier than the regular kind. Which do you prefer? Actually, I haven't had the first one, so... Oh. I don't know if you're supposed to take off the thing. the Because it like has little arrows where you can take it off. But I don't want to. It actually looks so pretty, doesn't it? Oh. <laughs> okay. Before you get distracted by my cat. Mmm. Smells like carbonated milk, and that scares me. You want to taste? He does not. That scares me even more. He eats and drinks everything. This is actually pretty good. See, I was so scared about this drink that it was going to taste like the um, pop-it drink that I had last time. You didn't get to see my reaction. Oh, 
in the last one we had beef stew flavored ramen. Disgusting. This is actually really good. I think it kind of tastes like this one, but I guess since because this is milk in it and this is yogurt, about the same. This is really good. So that officially ends my video. This one was the longest one I've done. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching my videos. Um, if you have any questions, like if, um, cause I think I'll, I'll look at the comments more and comment back to you more than I'll put up videos. So if you're like, Hey, when you're going to put up the next video, or if you even care, I will probably comment back to you because every so often I look at my videos and I get a notification if you comment. So thank you. Have a nice day or night as it is. It's 3.30 here, 3.34. And I have work tomorrow. So bye.